And um, as Monica kind of featured just a second ago, it's just a few more hours left until we all get to take part in something so rare. Of course, the solar eclipse. So many folks in our area and across the country are talking about this and anticipating this big event. Alyssa Chris Stanley, she's live in Center City with a look at how to view it safely and where to watch. Hey, Alyssa. Hey guys, this is so exciting, right? We're just hours away from witnessing something that we may not see again for a very long time or maybe even in our lifetime. And so many folks across the Philadelphia area, we're all obsessed with this, right? It's fascinating to us and a lot of us hoping to catch a glimpse of it this afternoon. But millions of Americans across the country have been gearing up for this eclipse all year long. I've been talking about the eclipse almost the entire year now. The most important thing is to protect your eyes. You don't look directly at the sun on a normal day, and you definitely don't look at the sun during an eclipse. We're not gonna have an eclipse quite like this one for another maybe 350 years. Well, the moon is expected to start its path across the sun today just after 2 p.m., around 2.08 to be exact, as we know Monica will tell us. But mid-eclipse time will be the highest coverage happening at around 3.23 p.m. in the Philadelphia area. Now, we're not in the path of totality, but this is still rare as the eclipse reaches 90.1% coverage in the city at its peak. But it's still important to protect yourself, right? So take a look at some tips here on your screen to keep yourself safe as you view today. So, so important. Never look directly at the sun without eye protection. Always inspect those eclipse glasses or viewer before you use it and don't look at the sun through a camera lens, a telescope or binoculars while wearing eclipse glasses or using a solar viewer because those rays will burn through the filter and can really injure your eyes. Now, eclipse glasses are not the same as sunglasses. Regular sunglasses are not safe for viewing the sun. There's also a ton of places across our area that you can watch today. You can see those watch party locations right here on your screen. You can also see it by watching NASA live stream while well, father and daughter say they are excited to experience this moment in history together. I'm excited for tomorrow so it can happen. It's really cool. I mean, it happens very rarely, so it's really cool to experience this with her and her being so young and, you know, seeing it for the first time. Well, guys, remember, we only have a certain window this afternoon to be able to view this, right? That short window in the afternoon. So we got to be ready. We got to gear up. I know we're going to be. I got my glasses here. I'm one hand in it. Um, I think these work, guys, because I can't really see anything through it. So I think we're ready <laughs> for the eclipse. <laughs> Uh, Alyssa, Not you, are, thing. you are <laughs> so ready. By 323, hopefully she can get the other ear on. Yeah. Okay, that's, yeah. What, that's what we're hoping for. We're you, gonna Alyssa. do it. Y'all make sure you're using both hands. <laughs> Thanks, yeah. Alyssa. Yeah. And we have got.